believe what you see. I just picked up this cool little thing from Jack in the Box. It already smells so good. It's an Oreo cookie bar and it's got Oreo crumbs and cream all over it. Look at them crushed up crumbs. It's actually kind of interesting, isn't it? All compact. Look how fun the Jack in the Box bag is. It's got like games and trivia and a maze. Let's see what's going on with this Oreo cookie bar from Jack in the Box. It's just the top and bottom that are uh, Oreo encrusted. Whereas the rest of the bar is just a, uh, a regular old blondie. What do y'all prefer? Blondies or brownies? Let me know in the comments. It's good. It's just kind of basic. Um, it looks more interesting than it tastes. Um, because the cookie bar itself is just like a grocery store kind of tasting cookie bar. Um, but the Oreos are, uh, fun. I also picked up a boba milk tea. Um, it's got balls in it. You see them? They're in there. I'm not a big boba girl. Um, I've had those, like, drinks that have, like, juice balls in them. And those are good. But boba itself, I don't understand what it is. Let's find out. It's got boba balls in it. Like, uh -huh. I like the milk tea aspect, okay? But the boba balls are gross. Uh, excuse me. I think they're made out of tapioca or something. But they're just kind of flavorless and overly chewy, which isn't really um, something that I want when I'm drinking, maybe. What do y'all think? Do you like chewing on boba balls? Let me know in the comments. And if you dug this Jack in the Box review, then be sure to smash that like button for hightailing it on out of here. And be my sub, please. Please. Please click that subscribe button, please if you haven't already. As usual, it was a pleasure, and I can't wait to do it again or else soon in another fun food review. Thanks for watching. Bye!